All right, the rhythm this week. First half of the bar basically is helping, helping you get set up for the second half. So this is to remind you, you're making three picking motions for that note, which is the same over here. You, you hit this once, but you're going to make three picking motions. This way your hand is still moving with the 16th note patterns going on. Dotted eighth note is the length of three sixteenths. Again, the dotted eighth note is the length of three sixteenths. When you dot something, you extend the length of it by half. Half of an eighth note is one sixteenth. So, dotted eighth note, three sixteenth notes long. And remember, you can always go up slower than five beats per minute. Going up twos or even ones may be the best, best thing to do here, especially the more difficult parts. So, 50, number one, here we go. One and a two e and a three e and a four e and a one. End that with your index finger so you are prepared for the repeats. Hundred, one, two, three, four. One twenty, one, two, three, four. One forty, one, two. week will be more difficult than last I would think. Let's go back down to 100 and demonstrate some repeats. One, two, three, four. Repeats one, 
two, three, four. For some repeats. One, two, three, four. stuff. Reminder on what to do. So you're going to start with the no inversion, also known as root position. And from there, when you go from one chord to the next, you got to ask, does this next chord share any notes with the previous one? If the answer is yes, we keep those notes in the exact same place just as you did going from G to the C major chord. G and C share the G note, so the G stayed in the same place, giving us the C over G. If the Roman numerals are right next to each other, like the four and five, those, those chords will not share anything. That can't. And then the other thing is some of these progressions you also need to make sure that the last chord, if it shares any notes with the first chord, those are also in the exact same place. So sometimes you may want to go from the first to the last chord and kind of do a little bit of a backwards thing there. 
and then just the usual thing mode shape scale shape just up and down and i think that about covers it so any questions let me know and i'll see you again next week